I'm gonna swing on him. Oh my god, I think I just tapped him. I think I literally just one tapped him. Oh my god! Shoreline definitely lives up to being one of the hardest maps in Escape from Tarkov. With long raids and super difficult quests, Shoreline is a unique and challenging map that requires a different approach compared to every other map in the game. With a massive health resort in the middle, this map provides plenty of opportunity for PvP and rare expensive high tier loot. But the main reason I decided to take on this map is this. I don't know how, but I've been playing this whole wipe without a single junk box. This is what I really want. I really, really want this. I need it. I have never gotten a thick case before. Or a Ledex. The Ledex is one of the holy grails of loot in Tarkov. And with the thick case and many other items being taken off the flea market, I was super determined to get one from this quest. With my decision made, I headed into Shoreline with some decent gear and began my journey to find a Ledex. Not bad. Not bad. Imagine playing Tarkov for like, ten, like two, three hours. I play this shit for 12 hours. Shoreline is also known to have some of the worst spawns in the game. Getting to the health resort is usually accompanied by about 45 minutes of running, and that's only if you didn't get killed off spawn. Tetch Riz? Tetch with Riz? The health resort has so much loot and expensive items. The majority of it is hidden behind locked doors. So I did have to buy a couple keys. After only looting a couple rooms, my bag was already filled with loot. But I still hadn't found what I came here for. I wanted to get into West 301. One of the best rooms in the entire map. Of course. Shoreline is the only map in Tarkov where you should expect to fall over at any second. So I knew I had to change my strategy. And this might actually be one of the main reasons I started to like this map. You sick? I hope nah, I'm not. Get out the corner, bro. Running Shoreline at nighttime is actually a lot safer. Even with night vision, it's a lot harder to be seen than a lot of people play daytime, which made it a lot easier for me to get in and get out. One of the most overpowered combos right now is the SJ6 and the Trimital. You can literally run all the way to the extract and not stop once with these two stims. One of the hardest parts about Shoreline is spawning, going to the resort, and then going back to extract. good money but i haven't found what i was looking for this was definitely going to take longer than i expected but i was set on getting this ledx so i went to shoreline again and again and again I killed him. Oh, another one, another one in the hallway. I'm gonna swing on him. Oh my god, I think I just tapped him. Oh my god! Yeah. 
How did I not kill him, dude? I fucked. I couldn't shoot my gun, man. Hours went by, then days went by, and I still was not finding any Lettuxes. I was getting really tired of playing this map, and my luck just kept getting worse. I was just about to call it quits. I'm honestly getting tired of this, and I feel like I'm just wasting time at this point because I could be doing quests and shit right now. I could definitely be like at least level 40 right now if I just stop doing this. <laughs> First, I forgot all my keys. I didn't bring my keys. God fucking. And then the next raid, I didn't even bring a bag or a flashlight. I was just about done my journey of finding the sled X. So I gave it one more raid and then I call it. I didn't bring a bag either. Dude, I am just on the ball today, man. shit i need to get out of here after almost 20 hours of going in and out of shoreline oh my god dude what is going on right now i need to get the fuck out of here i had finally found a lead x this was my first time ever and i knew i needed to get out as fast as possible that's shane terminal bro i'm fucking gone i'm gone please dear lord let me get out of this alive the race to extract has officially started i'm out of here dude please nikita no one let, let no one extract camp this bro holy fuck I'm lying right now. I don't care. Come on. Just a little more. Come on, bro. No extract campers, please. I could see the extract at this point. I was so close. And that's when I heard shooting. Yeah. With my heart racing, I just started to sprint toward the extract. I was not stopping for anything. Oh my god, 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 oh my god. I'm gonna fucking throw up. Holy shit. Oh my god, I did it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> 1.3 mil, that's fucking crazy, bro. Finally. Oh my god. There it is. Wow, we fucking did it. Oh my god. <gasps> This is amazing. <laughs> Fucking did it. Let's go. Probably one of the worst runs ever, too. Oh my god. I had finally got what I set out to do. My first thick case and my first lead X. Shoreline became one of my least played maps for the most. And as bad as people say it is, I can definitely say I improved my PvP and made a lot of money doing it. Subscribe for more and follow my Twitch.